welcome back to my channel. My name is Natalia, the friendly creator behind Akai Hana Art. And for this community, I create videos and products to help you start creating with your iPad, either if it's illustration, design, or digital planning. So if you like these kind of topics, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so you won't miss anything, and like the video if you want to watch more videos related to this one. Okay, you guys, here I come with another video about the new range of products that I'm creating for Fun Digitals, that is the little brand that has come out of Akaihana Art. If you don't know what Fun Digital is, I already uploaded a video about it. But if you haven't seen that, I will leave the link in the description down below and also up here so you can go and check that one out. Just to make a little quick update, uh, Fun Digitals, it's the new brand of already finished design uh, digital products such as uh, digital stickers, digital planners, digital journals. Uh, the main reason for the name and the brand is that I wanted to create digital products that people would love to use because they are colorful, they are easy to use and they are made basically for quirky people, happy people such as us. In this video, I'm coming to present to you the first fun doodle planner. And that planner is a bullet journal style type of planner. So the planner, it's already hyperlinked. So uh, we have the index with hyperlinks to all the pages. We have pages with numbers that you can uh, create the layouts that I told you already. And you have to go back to the index and write on top of that list the things that you added uh, for your particular planner to, um, to that index. I also added vision boards and things to check out or things you might like, places you visit, uh, package tracking, I don't know, I have a lot of things that I want to show you for that planner. So without further ado, let's get to good notes and let me show you the fun little planner and let me give you a walk through the buttons that have we have in the top part of the planner and the rewards program that you will access once you purchase uh, this planner or any planner that comes with Fun Digitals. Okay, so this is the cover of the planner. And if you tap in the cover, you will get, you will access the planner. This is the first page, that is the introduction page. And also you have this pocket that you can add stickers to this, this um, page. On the top of the planner, uh, we have the buttons with all the services that you can um, access in this planner. And if you are in the respective uh, section of the button that you are seeing, you can see that the button changes color. The cover is the only place that you won't, won't see a button, but if you click in the cover, you will open and access the cover, the open book, sorry. This is the calendar and also the calendar is hyperlinked to all the months of the planner. So you can access the month of the planner from the calendar or also from the index. Uh, here we have all the page of the index. And on top here, uh, there is another menu that will allow you to access all the pages on the index. We have six pages, six index pages. And I, I took the freedom to add the pages that we are already filled with layouts. Um, but if you want to add something extra, that's why I made them gray. Okay. These empty spaces are empty pages. I add them dot because um, some of you want to write on top of them or journal or create more layouts and then you can add the thing that you did in that blank page. You can add them to your index and you will able to access them um, 
later. Uh, with these numbers, you can access all the uh, pages of the index and you can go back to the first one. Uh, you can access the first one from here and from there, okay? Perfect. Another great thing about this planner is that we have logout and login pages. These uh, pages will allow you to be more mindful of your year, plan ahead and things like that. For example, this is the future log. You can add here goals for that month in particular, deadlines, birthdays, important dates. Again, up here we have more menu uh, buttons. We have future log, we have goals, and I created this Words Matter page from the Bean Bass podcast. I love it. So we have Word of the Year, Affirmations, and Focus of this year. Because I think that if we focus on something in particular, you will be able to crush it on the year. Uh, I added um, some dots in order for you to write and to have a space for writing, but also I added my goals for personal and professional. Either if you want to add pictures or things like that, or write on top, you can do that. Here we have the vision board, and I will be doing a video on this particular uh, spread, uh, but later, okay? Uh, this is another great, um, a layout and this is Polaroids. It's basically for you to add pictures uh, for highlights of every single month. You can add pictures and write uh, the things that you are doing in that picture. It's like a little diary but in pictures. Uh, for this we have the first six months and I added the theme of that month next to the image. And here we have the other six months. Okay, so uh, another great uh, layout that I added. I just wanted this to have a little bit of a scrapbooky style. So, okay, this is my packages, and since the pandemic. Uh, most of us have increased their orders online, their purchases online. So for me, it's very challenging to know where I bought from, uh, what I bought, and if something arrived. So for this, I created this little layout that says package from, product, tracker number, arrival, arrival estimation date, and also if, if the products arrive or not. And here, down here, I wanted to add wish list uh, for Christmas or for birthdays. We have tons of pages with this, so you can um, create a lot of uh, orders for your purchases. This is another great layout that I'm in love with. Um, I took this idea from from Amanda Ratchley, and this is things I might like uh, for music, TV shows, podcasts, books, and movies. I'm a sucker for all this type of information, so I added a lot of space for this layout. And I also, as we do a login, we have a logout. But I will leave those spreads for uh, as a surprise once you purchase this planner. Okay, now we're back in the index and I want to show you the spreads for every single month. You can access the monthly layouts from the calendar and also from the index. So let me show you uh, when you get to the planner part uh, what you can get. So here we have, we have the, co the cover, uh, we have a quote, some, um, illustration, doodle illustrations, and monthly goals. 
we want to to know to check our uh, goals for the month um, and you have this section every single month now we can access the monthly spread you can see that up here you can access all the services that we have each month so we have the monthly with it the the doodles uh, we have the trackers for mood tracking and for habit trackers and also our monthly intentions um here we are in this page that is one of my favorite pages all of these or every single month have their own theme and every mood tracker have their own uh doodles so so you can um be creative uh with the colors and things like that you only the only thing that you have to do it's color every single month and uh, once you have uh, finished, once you are in that particular day, you can paint the, um, the doodle. And at the end of the month, you can see how many colors that you have. If you, if you have mostly green or mostly pink, you can see that if you, have, you have, if you have been mostly happy, mostly, you know, content or things like that. Um... So for this, I use the highlighter because otherwise you will cover the entire uh, illustration if you paint with the writing tool. So that's why I love to paint with the highlight tool. So this is not easy, but once you get the hang of it, I know that you will be able to create nice a painting you can also do this with the other doodles if you want to give them color you can color them with the highlight okay here we have the mood now here we have the list and here we have the weekly and after this we have the blank pages that you can fill with anything that you like um you can go back and forth with the the back and forth arrows and you can see that you have here uh, the five weeks of the month and also you have four or five different pages uh, for blank uh, use you know for yourself okay so we are here back in the calendar let me show you another month let's say for example April and here we have the cover for April, the cover, the doodle. And you can, as I was telling you, you can also color the doodles using the highlighter. Uh, you can color them. And um, you are going to be able to have nice, colorful um, layouts like this something like this for example and this is this is going to turn into a colorful page a color page and you know that will be great for release the monthly is undated here we have the mood tracker the lists the weekly layout and the blank pages uh, all of these for all the months of uh, the calendar and remember that you have to fill the index with the blank pages in order for them to work as a bullet journal now this part you're going to get it with good notes uh, these are the pages for stickers I add them the stickers here uh, they meant to be blank pages, no dots, no nothing. Uh, I added these uh, stickers 
and you're going to get them with the good notes file but if you don't have good notes uh, you are going to get them as png single files last but not least uh, this is the community button if you click this button you're going to be able to go to an external link that goes but directly to the facebook group if you have purchased the product, you have to write me a DM or an email uh, letting me know that you purchased the product. Otherwise, you won't be able to access. Uh, if you run into the group, if you try to enter, most likely you are not going to be able. These clips are going to be the first reward that you are going to get once you purchase this product. These are PNG files, single files that you can use as paper clips. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you find it useful and you uh, get a little uh, curious about the Fundable Planner. Before I go, I have to tell you a couple of things. First of all, the product is already available on uh, the Etsy shop for Fun Digitals. So I will leave the link in the description down below where you can get your Fondoodle Planner. Uh, don't forget that you also uh, can get the monthly calendar. That if you haven't seen the video, I will leave the link in the description down below so you can go and check that video out. Also, the Fun Digital Facebook group is going to be only for the people that purchase the products on the Fun Digital uh, shop. So you will access the community directly from the planner, but the only thing that to be able to enter, you might have to uh, send me a DM or an email uh, showing me that you purchased the product. So I'm, I'm able to access the, um, the Facebook group for you uh, if you have purchased the planner or the calendar please let me uh, any comments down below if you enjoy the video or if you want to know more a little bit more about the product or uh, what type of videos do you want me to create with this product leave me the in the comments down below what type of uh, videos would you like to see or what type of products would you like me to create Finally, if you like videos like this and you want to watch more videos about it, please give it a thumbs up and spread the love by sharing to the people that you think might be interested in these type of topics. Again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!